Hello and welcome to another episode of Combat Designer Let's Play. I think is what I'm calling the series. Oh god, where am I? Okay. I think I was headed down there. Plan Lies of P still. I keep calling it Life of Pi in my brain. Which I think is that movie with the tiger and a boat, right? That's the whole deal. Okay, let's oh blah, come to life. That dude has a big old sword. Um, let's separate these guys. Ooh, ooh, and then another one. Okay, let's de-rust. I really need to just spend a while blocking and then beating people up to see what's up with that blue bar. Okay, let's... I lose a bunch, lose a bunch. It doesn't seem to cost any of that blue when I block. Which I guess makes sense. Do I lose it when I get hit? God, I hate science. Okay. Let me at. Come, get at me. Okay, nope, I don't lose any when I get hit. So how does it work? It's super opaque, this system so far. Um, Yeah, I need my heals again. Oh, when did I get an extra heal? How did I miss that? Um, Screw you. Yo. That was cool. That lasts a really long time, that lightning. Okay, I'm, I'm done with the blocking science. I don't care. I don't get it, and I don't care. I am comfortably dumb. I wonder if that's key to max health or not. Oh, oh, what is... This is a new... What the hell? Is this the petrification disease? There's like alchemical. Oh, we did learn there are alchemists. There is something alchemical going on on top of the. Like, Geppetto is the mechanical arm, and then there's an alchemical arm doing other seemingly bad stuff. I wonder if that shortcut existed just to get me to look at that. I'm hearing lots of loud noises. Oh, what the? Oh, that that is huge. All right, let's go kill a big thing. Ooh, after reading some news, Mr. Vanini's ambition to make a jolly police mascot puppet for City Hall ended in failure. His passion to make a trustworthy friend for the citizens and a strong officer who overpowers criminals was in the right place but turned out to be excessive. The new police officer's puppet overcharged storage battery exceeded its capacity, causing chain explosions, malfunctions, and serious body damage. City Council recommended disposing of the puppet on the grounds that its appearance intimidated visitors, but Mr. Vanini and the taxpayers protested, halting the council's plan in its tracks. The puppet still lies abandoned behind City Hall to this day while the lawsuit is ongoing. The interesting thing is, even when the puppet is unattended, it performs a number of its mascot roles. It is especially popular with kids, ugh, and it even appears to react and respond to the playing of children. However, it has led to more slum children entering City Hall, causing inconvenience to visitors. The city council is considering exhibiting the puppet only occasionally as a means to restrict entry. Like, homeless kids? Kids are coming like poor kids are coming to hang out with a cop robot and their reaction is no like you're getting kids off the streets shouldn't shouldn't that be good okay this is a giant dude with no head oh that was close i greeted that a little bit but it worked out game gave me a stun thank you game Did not give me a stun there, but that's okay. I didn't deserve it. Oh, I caught him midair. That could have been bad. He's still alive. Stop, jump. Fable Catalyst, start fighting. Okay. 
Nothing fancy. Oh no. No survivors here. What Broken do we do? baby Just puppet? Give her that baby puppet. Oh, this the woman's kid is dead? Oh, this is gonna be a full from soft quest where I have to give this lady the most depressing news in the world. I'm not gonna enter. I'm gonna draw this dude out. I don't I don't know what's going on in there and I don't care to find out. I just feel like I'm gonna get ambushed, right? I'm gonna stick to a side here. My back to a wall. <sighs> Let's circle strafe this nerd. I'm hoping that's not a thing I can do later in the game against stronger enemies. It's fine for trash. Puppet Destroyer's Amulet. Aren't I Puppet? Shouldn't that, like, frighten me? Increases damage afflicted on puppets. An amulet that can be equipped on a puppet. Information, blah, 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 blah. Crush, crush, crush. The Executioner Puppet didn't know the reason or significance, but carried on its role, for sure. Your movement speed and stamina recovery speed slow down. Okay, so my weight reduces my stamina recovery. To awaken a specter. Oh, I think this is how I summon buddies to help me. Does that mean there's some scary nonsense through this door? Use a star fragment at the cracked calling next to the boss area to summon a specter. It will help your character in the boss battle. Um, let's try without first. I'm not someone who's against summons conceptually as like a, a design element. Oh, there's nowhere else to go. Um, but I always like to see what I can do on my own. I find the fights more engaging when I'm solo. Alright, what's it gonna be? This feels like a major boss. A lightning? Is it coming out of the tower? It totally is. Or rather out of this guy. Oh! Robocop. How did you ever think building this was a good idea? Why is it allowed to do that? You built a Robocop and you were like, you know what would make it comfortable? Is if its head could turn up 360 degrees. And it did that all the time. So they're totally trying to communicate with me. Okay, we're gonna... Okay, that was really satisfying. I did the, um, the hilt or my handles fable to block that because I wasn't sure of the timing on it. Should have done it that time too, I guess. It's a very cool boss. At least visually. I, I'm a sucker for um, unique models. I know they're hard to do. Oh god, I'm dying. I'm too busy admiring. God damn, block anything, dude. Can I get a stagger? jumped me. Fucking Ultra Instinct, dude. Where was that this whole fight? Oh, I have to get to this specific spot. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Okay. They've got that silly Bloodborne thing where after you dodge, if you light attack, you don't get the, um, the execute. Wow, that... Perry string was sick. That was a lot of fun to do. Oh, it's got me here. 
I unlocked a shortcut somewhere. Was it this door here on the left? Yeah, it was. 5,400 runes on the floor. Er, er, yeah. Uh, let's not. I guess if I fight them, I do charge up my, um, what's it called? My fables. So I should fight at least these guys and see what I can get out of that. Oh, did, is that a new thing I just noticed? Here, let me kill this guy. Please don't hurt me. Oh, it's super subtle. Listen, listen as I start up this charge attack. There's like a winding, like I'm cranking up. It's not happening anymore. I don't know what happened. Did I break it? Did I overdo Oh, and there it is again. I don't know. Okay, let's try again solo because I am stubborn. God, I can't wait for this to be a 40-minute video of me just getting my ass kicked by the same boss over and over. Maybe I stopped trying to parry everything. Well, that's what I did for the first boss, and it really worked. I just gotta learn the timing. That always comes out a little sooner than I expected to. That also, I just don't see coming at all. Getting all quiet because I'm in I'm in try hard mode now. Okay. I wonder if that's bespoke. I really doubt it. That's probably some kind of generic thing. Um, I was saying before about the model. I know it's really expensive to create big, fancy, unique models like this, but they're always so cool. There was um a lot of discussion about Elden Ring's bosses. People seemed kind of dissatisfied with a lot of the actual combat experiences. And I felt like what FromSoft was going for was just spectacle with so many crazy unique bosses. Oh! And I get why that might not be a satisfying experience for people, but God, was it cool to just see what they could do. Oh, he's so much faster now. Oh, and struck me with lightning. Please don't! I am so lucky I'm alive, dude. Get wrecked! Whoa, spent all my stamina there because I wasn't afraid. Well, I got him into phase two, but that wasn't even 50% health. I wonder how much health this guy, or uh, I wonder if this guy is more than two phases. Yeah, I have, like, I have no time at all to read that hint. I saw something about the privileged and the caretakers. Man, I spent so long talking about, you just need to get a lot of health because you can uh, outlast just about anything. And now I'm just getting dunked on by Robocop. I did not think having a lot of um, fable made a difference. It was kind of nice in a couple moments. Let's let's try a combat where I'm more focused on dodging. I just don't know if that's what I'm supposed to do with the heavy weapon. Oh, there's someone behind me. Oh, I broke his weapon and he still just said, oh my god. This went from so good to so bad. Well, what are you going to do? Let's go int again. I wonder... Okay, so he's lightning-y. 
You know, if I die this time, I will summon it on the next time. Because I don't want to sit here and take videos of me just dying over and over. What does that do? Ooh, that does a good amount of damage. I didn't know that would attack. So I went pretty cautious. Pairing doesn't cost any stamina, which is really nice. Broke my block. Alright, got the crit out. Oh, getting a critical hit also eats any of the um, incomplete damage. Oh, I blocked that actually, or I parried it rather. Oh, that's a grab! I didn't know this game had grabs! Oh! <laughs> Oh, you didn't even, like, throw me? I just have to stand right next to you? I felt like the game gave me those dodges a little bit. That was weird. I did not think my timing there was correct. recognize it just a second too late and I panic blocked because that's what I've been using ow ah oh, no <laughs> killed me through my block oh, that was I'm dying but I'm actually having a lot of fun that was really cool I am getting a little further each time which is nice okay let's see what summoning is like Souls games, I just, you gotta accept death is how things are gonna go. You just hope to learn something every time. So what I, so far the main thing I've learned is in that second phase, that new unblockable he gets, if you just panic block that, it's gonna work like 100% of the time. So hell yeah, that's pretty nice. I'm out of stamina. I'm not being followed, am I now? I would also really like to enter this arena with full health at some point. Like, if that were an option, that would be cool. Oh my god, and instead I'm just terrible. Okay, whatever. Oh uh, yeah, let's check this out. Now, does this summon another player? Or, like, a, a puppet? I guess we're about to find out. Do I not have a panic repair? Oh, I, I have it bound to secondary menu. Okay. Oh, I know why I'm losing. I need my lamp. There we go. Alright, well this seems like it summons players and I don't actually want that. If it summons uh, uh, NPC, I'm all for it. Oh wait, Spectre, health. Oh, they're just in the battle waiting for me. He is just... I think it's a she. She is just mangling this thing. Tension's on her for now. Oh, that's a new unblockable. Ooh. 
Oh no, it ate my critical hit. That sucks. <laughs> Stuck on the terrain. Oh, is that all gonna strike? Yes, it is. Okay, I've got the execute. I'm gonna I'm gonna botch it. Yep, didn't get it. I actually couldn't parry that because it wasn't facing me. Oh, it seems like you get the stagger more quickly a second time if you miss it the first. Yeah, and look at all that extra health just disappear. Okay. Summon was too strong, I think. Yeah, like, I I used one potion there. There's a second. Eliminated. Overcharged stored battery. Broken heroes ergo. Core quartz. Oh, God. Why do the UI elements last for a quarter second? Let me read, Mon. Let's, let's try and look at everything. I do have broken here. Okay, obtained from the scrapped Watchman. It is packed with immense power. Watchman contorted and broke from the adult's desire, desires. However, he never forgot the children who considered him their friend. Oh, that's so cute. And then I murdered him. Um, star fragments I've got. Overcharged storage battery. Scrapped Watchman's central core, the Legion arm with immense power, can be crafted by Eugenie or Benini Craft Machine. The plan of Crot City Hall's Watchman ultimately failed. The Watchman, whose storage battery had swelled and back had bent horribly, became an angry judge and swept through Elysian Boulevard. Okay, so I can turn this into a fancy arm. Core, Porgon, core part, a key part that can activate the Porgon. Activating the Porgon allows quartz to be equipped. The Porgon is the quintessence, or quintessence, of the brilliant craftsman Japan's puppet skills. Rare parts are necessary to develop a dice like, device like that. I can't use it. Oh, this seems like, okay. It'll allow me to equip quartz, whatever quartz is. Do I bring this lady her doll? I'm gonna be like, hey, your daughter's dead and she's gonna do something horrible. Um, let's go home. Let's see if we can get this new arm crafted, level up, see what else we can do. Oh, Sophia's gone. Or, no, she's just on the stairs. Okay. Do I level up at her or at this? At her. Okay. I never talked to you. Are you, Welcome you're... to Hotel Crop. My name is Polandina, butler to Lady Antonia. Please let me know how I may be of service. At Hotel Crot, comfort and calm walk hand in hand. Can't be Welcome like a beer. To Hotel Crot. How? Purchase. Oh, he sells. Oh. I also love it when games just sell you an infinite amount of stuff like Fable Catalysts. Oh, I'm slightly heavy. That didn't show earlier. <laughs> in my so so this is literally later uh in the night from my episode two and one which i i did this morning now it tells me my actual weight amount based on what i'm wearing that's you know i i wish it had done that this morning but i guess i'll take what i can get so if i go here so 60 is slightly heavy is there like extremely light yeah there is light but I think I cannot... Yeah, I, I just can't be light while I hold this sword. This blade. And I like this blade, so I'm keeping it where I thought... Yeah, she was over here. Cool part you got there. Come here. I picked up traces of high-powered energy originating far away. That's one mystery solved. Why don't we make a legion arm with it? Mr. Vanini is the expert when it comes to legion arms. But I'm pretty sure I can make one. Mr. Vanini. The puppets get fried easily by electricity. If you use an electric... Fulminus. Fulminus? So 
I've got the left arm of steel. Geppetto's name is faintly engraved on them. So this is better scaling with my motivity or motivity. Legion arm that holds powerful electricity. It accumulates electric blitz and discharges an electric shock. Lightning has been interpreted as God's authority and fury since ancient time. Now God's fury descends to the earth and it is being used to destroy steel monsters. That's all a little dramatic. I, you know, I, I wasn't going to go straight to I have the power of God in my arm, but you know, to each their own, I suppose. I'll, I'll god punch someone if you want me to. Wonderful. He is on the second floor. He can hardly wait to see you. I'll go talk to Geppetto. I'll use my power. The first blow me up. Oh my god, I've got eight levels. That's all. I, I just hoard money. I never think to actually go spend it. Um, maybe I maybe I should have some stamina by now. I am struggling with stamina from time to time. Like, if I could just level up at the Stargazers, I, I'd be spending my money, but I can't for whatever reason. I also probably have an absolute million. Okay. I don't have that many. I think I can see what it would cost to level up under character info. Required ergo 1477. Oh, so I need, like, a single thing. Okay. I'll use my power. I think I want more stam. Let's see if we can get that up to 10 before going back to health and damage. Where are you, Geppetto? This place is gorgeous. A little gaudy, but I, I think intentionally so. Oh, and then there's just like broken railings, of course. I think this room is new. Why, why is there a fireplace with absolutely nothing? It's just ambiance? What if I want to sit at the fire? What is this? Ah, you've returned. Forgive a sentimental father for worrying about his son. Always remember that you're precious to me. Even when I ask you to do something dangerous. Speaking of which, there's a factory just beyond the Lysian Boulevard. It's packed with countless puppets. My friend, the inventor Vinini, went to stop them, but he never came back. Please go save him and shut down the factory. Oh. Key organs are the source of your powers. Collect quartz to get the strength you need. Hmm. Remember, the hotel is the last safe place in Krat. It's our only refuge in a city full of perils. It'll be extremely dangerous if anyone has ill intentions. Why would you bring that up, old man? Be careful who you tell about this place. Mm. Especially if they're stalkers or alchemists. Shit. Be wary of dangerous people. And always be a good boy to me. I'm not convinced you're good people. What the fuck? See, the P-Organ slots to activate your character's latent abilities equip quartz on the Porgon to obtain its corresponding effect. If you equip quartz in each of the slots in a single group, you can gain the group's synergy effect. Each time the synergy effects of two groups are activated, the next step is unlocked. You can get a greater variety of effects as you take your Porgon to higher phases. So I've got a skill tree? I've got a skill tree. So do I need to get all four of these before I can get the next phase? Ooh, double dodge. More health. 
increase the time of an enemy staggerable status. I was talking about that in the boss fight, how often I, I don't have time to get those. Increase fable slots. I've not really been using those, but I would like to. I I think something I don't like about the way I tend to play these games is I have the way I like to do them and I stick to them, but I would like to interface more with the unique mechanics these guys are presenting me with. So maybe I should... This is a lot. Enhance the stagger attack of charge attacks. Enhance the attack of fatal attacks. Those are those um, executions after you've got someone staggered. Enhances the attack of fable arts. Increases an enemy's staggered duration. Weird that that's both a quartz option and an outright um, link slot or whatever these are called. God, enhances guard regain recovery when attacking enemies. I still don't know what that does. Enhances discharged pull cell upon a fatal attack. Ooh. So after I get a fatal attack, I recover more pull cell. Lowers the damage received when pull cells are discharged. That sounds really nice. Lowers the enemy receipt. Ah, oh, damage received while dodging. That also sounds really nice. Charges a certain amount of legion when an enemy is eliminated. That's dope. I'm going with that, I think, for sure. Um, stamina consumption of charge attacks. Charges fable when a perfect guard is successful. Oh my goodness. Enhances charge effect of legion magazine. Increases the amount of ergo gain from eliminating enemies. Oh, that's just more experience. Ah, I have to. I'm, a, I'm I am greedy. Okay, so I have increased the amount of ergo gain from eliminating enemies. If I also fill this slot, which is going to cost me another quartz, that's when I can. Um... That's when I can get the effect of increased fable slots. Okay. So if I'm already leaning into the fable thing, then maybe I do that over charging legion, but I get I get fable already. I have no way of regenerating legion. Why was that a warning? Okay, and then I've got to activate two or three of these to get to the next window. I kind of like that I can't look at them yet actually. Like that was already a lot to digest in a small moment. You can get from City Hall to the factory with the key. So, does this hurt? Nope. Yeah, that was already a lot to digest. Blocking off the the ladder trees was a bit of a mercy because I would have felt the need to look at everything. Uh, oh, there's a little doll icon. Okay, let's go tell this lady that her her child died horrifically. You know, like you, like you sometimes do. Exceptionally talented, tenacious genius, craft is man. All puppet technology and Krat was born of his hands. So, he he crafted the problem, and now he's hoping to craft me the solution. How do I know? He's not a puppet, dude. Aren't we like all puppets, man? Okay, that was just the bodiest swing of my life. Ow! Okay, I'm just not caring because I need to turn in this quest, but holy crap, maybe we don't just let everyone bully me. The Light of the Heavy is so nice for single targets. I wish the range on the basic light was a little longer, but I think that's me being greedy. I don't think I deserve it to be longer. I'm just needy. <laughs> Hurl him off the rooftop. All right. Excuse me, ma'am. Oh, I should try my lightning arm on someone. I do feel very comfortable using my heals because I know I'll get them back if I run completely out. That's a really nice feature. Okay. You found her. Guide one. Wait, her daughter is the doll? I could sense her from Please let me hold her. Oh. 
there, there, my baby. I missed you so Is much. Is that? That looks like a human hand. What do you think? Is my baby adorable? That's right, kind one. You've granted me my only wish. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and be kind there. My sweet Elaner. Elaner. We're going to be happy now. Thank you so much. Kind She's one. got like scales growing over her eyes and stuff. She's having Please a bad time. Do you want me to like put you down? Heartfelt gratitude. Or do you just want to sit there and cuddle your puppet? Like I get it. I got a vivid ergo fragment. <laughs> Can listen to the music on records to gain humanity. I wonder if that's um the like renegade slash paragon or whatever, your morality is specifically your humanity. Ooh, that was pretty cool. Is there sprinting? Nope. Kapa! Ooh, that was chunky damage. Okay. I mean, right now I'm just mindlessly killing things to, mindlessly killing things to see what's up with my new. Hours. This is where I had to fight that dude on the bridge. That's very creepy. Didn't we learn we should just let me have stamina outside of combat? Just let me run. Just trying to get from point A to B. And we will teleport back to the courtyard now that we've completed our quest. We're being nice. We're nice people. Ergo is a miraculous power stone. Does all Ergo come from like one rock or something? Um, all right, I'm gonna assume it's this way. Let's take a second to appreciate the courtyard. Is nice. Vanini's Guide. Dear citizens of Croth, the factory has been occupied by puppets. Whatever the cause, Vanini Company is responsible for it. I, Lorenzini Vanini... <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I'm going alone to stop those devils. The factory is very dangerous now. Stay out of it and keep safe. The rest I'll leave to Mr. Geppetto, whom I trust more than anyone. God save us all. Regards, Lorenzini Vanini. Okay, so they are certainly trying to portray Vanini and Geppetto as relatively good or well intended like their intentions are good even if you know their creations are horrible chamber of the machina workshop oh that's the out vium invenium out facium i should google that ergo is life It's a pitiful roll. Nothing over here. Here it is. The Nini works. Everything you see here belongs to the Nini. The classiest playboy and most brilliant inventor in Krat. Just ask him. Say, I thought Not you were kind of genius. Almost every machine and tram in Krat is supplied from here. You gotta be curious about the guy. What kind of person is he? Uh, what? Find him. Fuck, it's a little girl. He's still kicking. Hated that. Buy the miracle medicine here. Oh, goddammit. By the miracle medicine here, the miracle ac the miracle alchemist Clark Shore, also known as Doctor Cureall, has succeeded in making a cure for the horrible plague that has spread through Crot. How do I? 
Made from unicorn horn, blood of a two-headed snake, and boiled down mandrake, Clark Shore has tested it himself and confirmed that it completely cures the plague. The blue plague is not a divine curse. Don't be afraid anymore. Come see Dr. Cural Clark Shore. Prices may vary as it is. Okay, so that thing we saw earlier locked up against the wall in like blue tendrils like uh the arrival that was indeed the petrification which is also the blue disease which some people think is divine get murked okay i actually want to go back up and it looked like i could scale the roofs to an extent I miss having a crop. Oh! They got me. Does that dude have a gun? I mean, not anymore, but I think he did. Okay, and now I gotcha. Ah ha ha! You too, jerk. Overheat. Okay, I was dealing with lightning, now I'm dealing with fire, it seems. Oh, you didn't let me get a jumping attack there? That would have been so cool. Lame. Fatal Catalyst. Is that just an open sewer? That sounds about right. All right, let's do it, big ugly. Fulminis, bah! Oh, little girl. This Fulminis is not as fast as I'm used to. Commit! Got him. Alright, big scary down. Can I jump down? I can't jump down here. I don't know if I should, but I'm gonna. Aha! Uh -huh. And then I can get the drop on you! They just threw at me, but I did not enjoy it. Pizza cutters. Oh! You know what's interesting is these people with thrown weapons don't even have a melee. Oh, that didn't do friendly fire. That. Okay, reasonable, but I wish it. Oh, come on! He got hit by two. Old reliable. God, that is a satisfying... Like, the the hit pause and everything, just hitting stuff in this game feels really great. E even relatively big stuff. Like, the, the sound, I, I'm hoping it's as clear for you guys as it is for me. It's really crisp. There's a lot of texture to it. Foggy day. Still curious about why it's indicating, like, weather. We make tomorrow. Oh, hey, there is my next checkpoint. And we are at 45 minutes, so I think we're going to get there and call it. Unless anything incredibly interesting happens between here and there. Nope. Well, that is going to be all I've got for you guys in this episode. Thanks for watching. I've been Captain Scorch, and uh, I hope you have a great rest of your day.